The video that you're about to watch is simply mind-blowing. There's an extreme plot twist within this video and the next. He's walking now. Uh, I want everybody to be really prepared, take a lot of notes, and uh, buckle up because this one here is by far my craziest randonautica experience to this day. Literally are like that's insane. Flip -flop. That's crazy. <laughs> All right, what's up everybody? My name is CJ Faison. First and foremost, welcome to my channel. Second of all, welcome to another late night randonautica adventure, but stop right here because we're somewhere completely different. No, we're not in the Pokemon Forest. We are here in Las Vegas, Nevada. Now, this is kind of a continuation of the Pokemon Forest series. As most of you all probably saw, there was an itinerary that we had found with uh, Las Vegas credentials for a flight coming out of BWI. Long story short, that's the airport that I flew out of. And I actually put this tweet here on Twitter about, you know, oh my gosh, could you imagine if Valentino was on the flight? Now, again, we understand the odds of Randonautica, and I want to put that out there. The odds of us coming out here and finding anything with Valentino, there's probably a 15 to 20% chance, maybe. But there's a lot of cool content out here in Nevada, not only here in Las Vegas, Tonopah, Goldfield, all that. So this is kind of a West Coast series, a continuation, I guess you would say. So, I gotta say this, um, Sonny did not come. He had some personal stuff happening with his family, and I hope that you all can respect that. But I actually did bring in uh, Kevin, AKA. What's up, Kevin? Uh, what's up, Ready to Ham. Uh, you guys might have seen uh, him on some of my really, really old videos. He's been really busy with his life and I talked him in at the very last minute saying, yo dude, I need somebody to come with me because we're splitting up. So Chris and Jazz, uh, Chris is behind the camera here. Hey. Uh, Chris and Jazz, they're going one way. Kevin and I, we're going a completely different other way. We landed here this morning. Uh, we got some good lunch, we got a good dinner. We're, our bellies are full, we're ready to start randonauting. Now, I do have to say this, um, the stakes are a little higher here. We don't, we're not familiar with this area. I mean, we're really not familiar with the Pokemon, but no. it's kind of in my backyard. I feel a little bit more comfortable. So obviously we're all gonna be on edge and I apologize if you all can kind of feel that and sense that in the video. We're supposed to be getting content for you all, but sometimes uh, it's a little bit more scary than what meets the eye on camera. So without further ado, let's get going. So to start off tonight, I am going to go to Twitter and I put a tweet up a couple of days ago before we left for Vegas that basically says, hey, uh, if you have any intents, tweet them below. So that's what I did. So the first one is coming from Danielle Richardson. Uh, Danielle put a lot of them. Dark fascination, forbidden love, evil intentions, destined love, love notes, secret fascination. And I find this really, really interesting, all of these intents. But I first have to give a shout out to her son, Devin. So Devin, thank you and your mom for supporting these videos. And uh, Danielle, thank you for saying be safe. Out of all of these intentions she gave, I'm gonna go with forbidden love because it's Sin City out here, right? It's Las Vegas, like it's sin everywhere you turn. So I think that would be a good one to start off with. As you see, Jazz and Chris, they're still uh, putting away some of their camera gear and getting some of their other lights out and stuff. So uh, Kevin and I, we're gonna go ahead and start this app up here. And um, all right, let's see here. It's like riding a bike. All right. So going to go ahead, generate a location here, and uh, see where Rando Nautica takes us tonight. Forbidden love. There's a lot of that here. I've been involved in some of that years back. Especially around the yeah, MGM Grand Casino. <laughs> oh, man. I say nothing. The f There's no way that just happened. What's that? All right, hang on a second. Look at this. Literally takes us to the MGM. Dude. I just said that. Yo, what the f Dude. Here we go. I just talked about, this is, this is nuts. 
So I was talking about my intent is forbidden love, and I was like, uh, I, I laughed and joked around about, hey, you know, I've had forbidden love here in Sin City a couple years back or whatever. Yeah. And I said, particularly at the MGM Grand Casino. And then all of a sudden it goes boop, and it t it is literally taking us to right behind the MGM Grand Casino. <laughs> wow. I swear, bro, what the? <laughs> That's wow. crazy, dude. There's no way. <laughs> How does this shit happen? I don't know. People can say what they want about Random Nautica, but coincidences are a little too, like, I don't know. I'm yeah, speechless. Yeah. Yeah, man, be careful out They're there. They're too coincidental to be coincidences. Yeah. Don't get yourself in trouble, eh? With forbidden love or in <laughs> general? Uh, forbidden love. <laughs> yeah, Might be too late for that one. Ooh, let me bite my finger. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Easy, killer. All right, we're going. We'll see y'all later. <laughs> later, y'all be safe. Oh, never safe. Don't get bit by a scorpion, bitch. Don't be silly. Wrap your willy. Hey! Hey! <laughs> Oh fuck, I have a weird feeling about tonight. All right, so we're turning down here, and as you can see, the big green hotel and casino right there, that's the MGM Grand. And that thing there, I mean, I, I've had some pretty fun times there, but um, again, I don't know where Rando Nautic is exactly taking this. It's like the road right before MGM. So I guess what I'm trying to get at here is everybody, is this a coincidence or did the app literally just hear that and then generate the location really, really quick? I mean, this this casino is really popular, so I mean. Look at that abandoned parking. That's there, literally where it's look, taking us. Look, look at that. That's literally where it's taking us, bro. Oh man. Yeah, this big empty parking lot right here. Okay, yeah. Stop, stop. Isn't that where they had, was that, that was a, that's where the country concert was. Isn't that where the country concert was? No. No? Uh, I thought it was. This ain't the, where the festival was? What the hell, bro? Look, I'm not getting arrested in Vegas, so I'm not getting breaking in here. All right, there. you gonna stay here? Oh, you gonna jump in that fence? No, no, no I, I mean, I might. I just wanna see if there's something out there. All right, yeah, just stand outside the car. Make sure that you don't lock the keys in there or anything. Damn it, we almost had a wreck. What the hell? I don't know. All right, do y'all see anything that could be forbidden love? I know a lot of times I kind of scroll through here a little too fast sometimes or pan the camera. Damn, that's still in the plastic. I don't know. So, sorry about that. So I'm gonna go ahead and say that this is, whoa, hang on a second. What is that? driver's license. What the hell? Oh, holy shit. What do you got? Um, Carillo Rodrigo. You're now famous, Carillo. Wow, what the hell? I just saw that out of the corner of my eye here. Hold that. Yeah. Yeah. So, damn. Okay, I just, I, all I was going to say was like forbidden love and, and kind of go off the synopsis that, you know, maybe this was a bust of a location, but that's weird, bro. Why would the, why would a driver's license be right there though? I don't know, man. I don't know. Like, Holy somebody, shit. Maybe, uh, maybe a police officer came up to FYD and they dropped, they dropped it or I don't know. 
Dang, dude, what in the world? Let's see if there's anything else around here, man. That That's weird, bro. That's really weird. Oh, whoa, all right. Person no. Person no, something, almost looks like Cancer United, Stealing Moose, Inside United. My name is... What the hell is that? World, bro. No? I have no idea. I literally don't even know what we just stumbled across. It's so, like, it seems sketchy as shit, honestly. Right, open up on a huge can of worms. Dude, it really is. My name is... What? I don't know. Yo, look, there's a hat back there. Uh-uh. You ain't got the gloves on. Yeah, dude, this uh -huh, is that. Oh, bro, ew, somebody wiped their ass with that thing. Uh, what should we do with this? I don't know, but we, you know what, we, here, we, we're gonna turn that into the police. You know what I mean? Okay. I gotta blur that out, actually, so. Um, so this is one of these times where we're gonna have to turn that into the police. You know, just go to the local police station and turn it in and, wow. That was so weird, dude. I was walking, I just looked down, and it was right there. What the hell? All right, so I feel like a complete idiot because I went into the police station to turn a license in, and I'm trying to do the right thing because I would want somebody to do that for me. And the police officer, very nice guy, he's like, uh, sir, really nothing that we can do. We're not gonna go track down this person, obviously. Um, the best thing you can do is find a post office box and put it in there and it will automatically be mailed to the address. So I said, all right, cool. And uh, that's what we're gonna do. So we're gonna try to, um, on our ventures tonight, I'm gonna uh, stop and grab some fuel here though, but on our ventures tonight, uh, if we see one of those post office box or in the morning, I'm gonna go put it in there. So, um, and in the alternative scheme of things too, Kevin brought up a really valid point. He's like, Dude, what if this is something to do with Rando Nautica, not just a random driver's license found? What if that was something to do with Forbidden Love? So I took a couple of pictures of the driver's license and um, I'm, I'm just for our record, so that way if that name pops up at any point in time, you know, during our trip or even back home, we at least have record of it. Scour on Twitter for intents and I found one that I thought would be really, really interesting to do, and this is actually kind of cool, but uh, DC Corey uh, put up here a couple of different things. Answers you've been looking for, bloody, Vegas secrets, mafia, otherworldly, and then at the bottom it says, please use, please use mine, lol. So I'm gonna go with Vegas secrets. So let's go ahead, let's use this intent, let's fire up the Randonautica app here. And let's see where Rando Nautica takes us this time. I'm not gonna mention any type of buildings or names of anything. Um, I, I really want this to, um, I really want this to be genuine from Rando Nautica and not have something that I say and take us somewhere like that. I don't know, the whole MGM thing and the, and the driver's license has me freaked out a little bit. So uh, let's go ahead. It's taking forever. All right, looks like this is eight miles away. All righty, well then, let's go. All right, so looks like we gotta make a right up here at the stop light. Is that, yeah, all right. It's like, it, it's foreign area, obviously, but it's so weird. Like not knowing exactly where you're at. I don't I don't particularly like that the most. Are we supposed to oh shit. Alright, oh. we gotta turn right here. What the hell is this? It's a key. Oh it is a park. It's a shop it's actually right, but it's a park. What the hell? Okay. Yeah. It's three hundred feet in there somewhere. That's where the pinpoint is, at least. Is that somebody walking around in there? You see that? Uh, yes. Yeah, that's somebody, bro. Yeah. Shit. Somebody with a bike. Okay, do we, like, just go, or...? Well, it says let's just go. All right. This is motherfucking sketchy, dude. 
dude. Yeah, there's multiple people walking around there, dude. Okay. There's people walking that way. Grab the keys here. Shit, yo, there's police lights over there. Did something happen? I don't know. Oh, that was fucking sketchy. What the hell's going on? Whoa, hang on a second. Bro, there's like people back there by that tree. Other people walking around too. I don't know about that, bro. I really don't. Smells like pee. Oh shit, there's cops over there too. There's police everywhere around here. Way off of the path here. We're at the we're right here. Nope. That stupid phone, dude. Like I'm low key, like just there's people like oh yeah, that's bad. Yeah, it's like it's like pinging like over near here. All right, that's a dud. There ain't shit around here, dude. Let's go. You know what I mean? Like there, there's like, there's two people over there, but I don't know what the hell they're doing. All right, let's just go back to the car. Look at that. There's paper. It's just a book. Uh, look like a yeah, St. Martin's paperbacks. It's a book book company. Confessions Whoa, of a mafia contract killer. What the fuck? CJ. What? CJ from your Twitter. They said mafia. Did it really? That, that wasn't the intent though. That tweet. That, that wait, a second, wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Hold on, dude. Let me look at that. Hang on. I was the one filming you. Holy shit, yeah, it did say actually Mafia. That's just a, I don't know, that could be a very weird coincidence, though. So. Page out of a book. Oh shit, that's another page out of a book. I found these before. Alright, 343 is underlined. Room 31, that's underlined. Is there anything else around here? What the hell is that? Damn. Hey, this is good though. Like, look around. Like, look around, see if there's anything else. I don't know what that is. I'm not gonna touch. Uh, it's like a lunchable. Ooh, That's a lunchable, yeah, yeah. bro. I wouldn't touch that. Oh, what? These yeah. rocks are deadly as hell. Get the hell off these things. Let's go around here. 
But definitely the. Yeah. You said it said room. What? Uh, it said like room 31 or something. Okay, that was weird. Guy on a bike. I guess so. How's it going? Alright, how you doing? Doing good. What the hell is going on? Oh, hang on. What's that? I'll meet you at the car, Kevin. I don't want you to break an ankle. Oh, it's a damn Burger King cup. Is there anything over there? No. No? I think it's just spray painted red. Hey, come over here real quick, Kev. So, I I don't know if this has anything to do with a Vegas secret, but room 31 is underlined on this page. Um, here, record me really quick. So, this is, um, I'm just going to... All right. Kevin brought up a really good point, and this is why I like Kevin to um, be involved uh, in, in this series, because he, he pays attention to detail, and I would have probably not even have put that together. Mafia and the word mafia in the tweet. Um, like I, I'm, I'm, I'm trying not to be like shaking or anything. I'm like actually shaking. Like oh, There were two guys that were riding around on a bike. There were two people, people that were walking just around over there. I don't even know what they were doing, but... I want to read this. Detective Pat King quickly found out that a body had, in fact, been discovered in room 31. That didn't necessarily prove that what Barbara had said was true. He was thinking, but it was sure as hell pointed in that direction. He asked North Bergen police if they'd return to the room and see if a lamp cord had been taken from the lamp there. Within a half hour, they called Kane back. The lamp cord was missing from the lamp. I don't know. I don't, I don't really understand room 31. Room 31, that's a Vegas secret, I guess. That was your intent, right? Yeah. Okay, now, sure that Barbara Deppner had told the truth, knew the inside story, Kane was confronted with a diabolical homicide and the possibility of another one. If this Richard... Something killed Gary for going to see his kid. Surely he'd kill Danny Deppner, and God knew who else. Kane first made sure to find a safe place for Barbara and her eight children. He then focused on his energy on locating Danny Deppner, getting to the bottom of what had happened. That's a lot to, uh, um, that's a lot to digest. I'm actually there. confused. Let's get in the car. <laughs> All right, so Jazz called me up. I'm going through like this little town right now. He dropped a pin and uh, basically told me to get here ASAP. I don't know exactly what's going on yet until we get here, but um, Kevin and I, we've uh, we've been having a rough day today. Yeah. This has been bust after bust after bust after bust. And um, I believe we are on our ninth bust. And a lot of it has taken us to, um, even out in the desert, believe it or not, it's taken us to a lot of private property, which is still, it's a little bizarre, um, but again, this is how Random Nautica goes. Like, we could come out here and waste an entire trip. So, I don't know. Um, I do want to show, it looks like there's some cars or any of these. Hang on, let me look at it. Oh gosh, all right, hang on. All right, and the pin, they're on the left. They're not over here, dude. Where the hell's her car? Oh wait, there, never mind. The damn G, I hate this GPS, dude. Anytime that I'm like going through somewhere, like if you like lose signal, it like lapses. Right, stops. Oh, on the left. Oh wait, there's our car right there. I love jazz, I really do. 
Um, a little concerned about why he said get here ASAP. Oh, they're they're literally yeah, they are in the desert. <laughs> I would make a jackass joke, but since we're in the desert and there's actual donkeys, I can't. Hey boys! Yo, somebody lost their mask. We're not wearing them. It's a the craziest thing that has ever happened. Huh? I'm not even lying. What? Not, get ready for this. Like maybe you want to sit down. Woo! Watch your step, dude. Holy yeah, I'm I'm Seriously, the, the gold jazz has. I'm literally shaking. I have chills up and down my body. We've got at nothing all day long. Look at that. We've been struggling. What was that? Yo! That's a picture of me! Yeah. What the hell's that? Where, like, where was that? What is, like, where's that from? It says, no! Be, be careful with that. There's there's a lot of personal information yeah, on there. Yeah, there's some stuff that you probably don't I'm want. I'm probably going to have to blur out a lot. Here, here, I'll read it to you. Just, just, just to be safe. What is that? A purse that we found. It has a lot of weird stuff in the it. Letter was that in says that. Gucci. Okay. It's it's a nice purse. I don't know if it's real. Okay, so does does this ring a bell to you? 20, Fucking 2014 One Oak at the Mirage. Yeah, why? So that's I'll always That's literally love where you. that was taken. I'll always love you, CJ Faison. I what the? No, fuck, I, dude. I did not know. I did. I've never seen you with hair before. Like I'm serious. I just never. I did not know. I I know you with I hair. You so I, when I saw that, I almost like. I've been walking in circles here for 15 minutes. Wait a second, minutes. hold the f up, dude. Hold the f up. Here, hold this for a second. I'm gonna read you this, this note, okay? The ones who aren't afraid to control life itself, I'll always love you. CJ Faison. All right, CJ, you ready? Dear CJ Faison. Can you I, stop for a second? Hang on. I, you have what? to read it. You have to. What? I'm talking. What? All right. Full disclosure. All right, I don't. This is weird, and and obviously somebody knows something. The dark-haired girl in the middle. I met her in 2000, and I believe it was 2013, when I was racing in NASCAR at Richmond International Speedway. Okay. Maybe she was, a fan. Is she a hundred percent fan? Okay. Holy. Shit. I still have I, I I still I still have like a weird vivid memory of this chick. I'm like shaking. no joke. I'm shaking right here. So it's nuts. Who the <laughs> Her name is Julia. No. No. I Come swear on, on my man. life. Come Dude, on, I swear man. on my life. I'm not fucking around right now, guys. I'm being dead serious. <laughs> Strike me Come on. now if I'm lying. Come on. Julia name, Ketterman. Ketterman. That, that's, that's Julia not, Ketterman. That's Julia Ketterman. No, that her last oh. name is not Ketterman. No. Well, bro, she's look like the message said talk about marriage. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let me see that again. Is it possible? Could I say her real name? I mean, I don't think it. Ow! F her. What the f was that? Really? Yeah. She's a fucking bit. Bro, there's some big spiders out here. Shit, bro. Great, fantastic. You right? Yeah. Dude, all right. What was what's her is, last is, name? Is that Shit. the Julia? The Jules I, Peaches Ketterman? Her is is it her? Okay. What happened with her? All right. I can tell you exactly what happened. I met her at Richmond, okay? We exchanged phone numbers or whatever, and I hung out with her two times. I uh, took her to a wedding that was in Spotsylvania, Virginia because she lived close by in Richmond. She was your date? Yeah, she was my date to the wedding. And then I was out the second time we ever hung out. She came to my house in North Carolina when I lived down there. And this was the third ever time I ever had anything with her, which was in Vegas. You brought this, her to this Vegas? This picture is in Vegas. You brought her here? No, I did not bring her here at all. She and her friend were here the same weekend that I was here for my birthday with my buddy Shannon. That's kind of weird. That's yeah. no, it's strange. And honestly, like Shannon made like a big joke about it. He's like, yeah, man, fangirl stalker, yada, yada. And I'm like, I, I, I really don't think someone's going to plan their trip around mine. And we did make a big to do on social media about it. And that's why Shannon was saying that they could have come. But anyway, uh, full disclosure here again, 
I was pretty tore up when this picture was taken, but the reason why I didn't, I mean, it was so. two years until I, until we saw each other again. And I, I haven't talked to her, I have not talked to her since this night, actually. And what happened that night? Can you? So I can elaborate exactly what happened. So we were all having drinks, having a lot of fun. We were taking selfies together. And then she started popping out the, the deadly three words that you could ever say, the I love you. It's in here. Are you f***ing yeah, serious? Yeah. I'm going to read this to you right now. Once again, I'm going to... I have to hide, there's a personal addresses on here. There's a lot of stuff. Yo, I'm Ted. never in my entire life setting it on social media where I'm going again. Yo, what if this is, you your full name is on that, like middle name, Your full that. name, no shit. your full name, like look. So I'm gonna, oh I'm, my f***ing God. So I'm gonna read this for the camera. Dear CJ Faison, I love you so much and I hope you're having the time of your life. Please be mindful of pickpockets and tourist traps. I know that you'll make good choices get nice and high on your adventures like on the mountains and stuff hold on dude i don't like i'm this. trying to avoid that certain stuff i pray for safe flights timely rides etc etc i love you forever and always have so much fun what she wants for souvenirs try to text and call me whenever you can because you already know i'm missing you dearly p.s no foreign pussy i'm not gonna say the rest always your girlfriend, future wife, bitch, don't forget that. On the other side, to my world traveler, love me. Which, I mean, there's no doubt you travel with huh? Yeah. Didn't you tell me you did that sky thing here in Vegas years ago? It's just, he's talking about high and lights and flight. Oh, you and bungee stuff. jumped, right? Yeah. And you did the zip line thing with the lights at free. Oh, my. Dude, what in the fuck? No like, way. she knows, like, she knows, there's like, no parts. Way. Either. Okay, actually. How else? Oh. Yeah. For what those who want to see, there's some stuff in here to say. What else is in there? There's a poker chip. Uh, makes sense because we're in Vegas. There's another Luxor room key. Oh, dude. I'm staying at the fucking Luxor. Dude. dude oh. We found one already in the Pokemon. We found a Luxor room. We found one in Pokemon How right before we, we got here? here. No. Stop. Seriously? On everything. Okay. You watch the part three. It's, all, it's in there, swear to God. Dude. There's five guys gift cards, Starbucks gift cards. A bunch of receipts. There's something common grounds. It's a hyenas, Massachusetts. I don't know what this is. Um, receipts. These are McDonald's receipts. We went through it already. I where's the like? Where's the McDonald's at? Is that here? Yes. Um, there's a there's a needle in here. No. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Dude, don't no don't mess with that. Don't yeah. Don't touch that. that. Does that seem like? I don't know. I don't know. Her. Does that seem like something that... I don't know, dude. I haven't talked to her since 2014. The I mean, last... When I was in Vegas in 2014, which was when that picture was taken... F I'm gonna double check just I in guess, case there's anything the else. The biggest thing to me is like this whole time, like Pokemo Forest, all the stuff that we have found relating to a Jules. Like, dude, I know the other guy in that Why picture. That guy, that guy was looking hard. That guy, look. What was that? Toyota. Some kind of black SUV. Yeah. Forerunner or something. Jazz, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm. Do you, do you think that? I'm freaking the fuck out at this point, dude. Do you know where you live? Yeah, probably not. Crazy. Like I, I don't want to like, like I don't. I'm not passing judgment on any one human being or anything, but I'm yeah, not, take that. I don't want that thing. Uh, I don't want that picture. Like, I really don't want that picture. But what, what? I'm not trying to pass judgment or anything like that. And I, and I know like mental health is like a huge thing, but like this girl was to the point where she literally thought we were like boyfriend, girlfriend, I love you by the end of the night. I would made no mention anything at all about that ever. Yeah, that's not cool. So what the fuck? I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I'm like losing my mind right now. You know, we're like one day in, right? Like this is one day. I know, that's what I, I feel. I feel like we need to well, like, tell our look around. Like, oh, our intention. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. Like, no, I wouldn't be surprised if she's well, like well, hiding behind took, one of these I took a crazy picture. bushes or some shit. I took a picture of the intent. What did you guys do? Our intent was uh, Sheila sent it to me, on uh, an answer to an unsolved mystery. Oh. And I mean, hey, if anything, we got an answer to what we're looking for. But is this our jewels, the one we're looking I, for? I'm gonna highly doubt it, dude. I don't. I don't. I don't know. I really don't know. And that's your buddy, Shannon. Yeah. You said. Yeah. I can confirm. I know. I gotta say, I know the guy. I know this is a long time ago too, because you had I mean, it here. We talked to her a while ago, though. So like, just thinking about the other people we've heard from. Aaron, oh Clyde. Fucking gosh. Told you about Johnny. Jonathan. Um, 
board, the military. Did you ever mention like a military boyfriend that lived out here? Because like the things we found last time were from we didn't even tell you Nevada much. Air Base. We there, talked a little bit at breakfast. Yeah, though. we told you a little bit, but there's a Jonathan Ward. We're he's all essentially yeah, that, but he's essentially just like this Air Force guy who lives in Nevada. He's stationed here apparently, and uh, we don't know how long ago. That's we don't thing. know how long ago. We don't know where he is. is. The I'm thing serious. is, I don't think you might be here, bro. Huh? Be here I feel sick to my stomach. I was gonna say you're right. There's a fucking picture of me in the middle of the desert. Like, if that doesn't make you feel sick to your stomach, what look, will? Look around us. Look around us. It's wide that? open. It's wide open. That's why I'm looking around. You know why? Picture frame was over there. The wall, it was over here. So I'm, I'm just... Yeah, there, there could be more. I don't know. I'm telling you, I saw a giant spider over there. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'll go over there, bro. I'll push it over there. CJ, how did I get out here, dude? Seriously. I, I don't know. Unless, like, she's fucking with me or has, like, hacked into my phone or your all's phone. Nothing happened today, though. Like, no, literally. No, nothing. Like, nothing. The entire day. It's taken us. We're in the middle of the desert, mind you. Yeah. And it will take us, like, four miles in this direction. And it's someone's house, like, up on the top of the hill but, with yeah. gates and shit. Like, it's been a complete waste of a day for us. Wait, so this, this Julia, wh what state did she live in? She That's, did, she, at the time thing. that I knew her, she was in Virginia. Dude, she she dude, lives hold in on, Richmond, hold on. Virginia. We she's, just, we I just would assume found, she still does. I don't know. We just found a luggage, like a pink luggage. It had the uh, the baggage claim sticker on it and everything. The the oh, the address on the luggage that. tag was from Richmond, Virginia. No, like the return come on. Address. On the it luggage is. tag. No, he's right. Oh. Uh, do, do you know if it's Richmond? I know for a fact that she lived in Richmond. I don't know where she lives now. She could live in yeah, but Aruba. Only a I don't know. Right? Dude, I don't know. Dude, like why? I don't. I don't understand. What the hell is going on now? Okay, let, I'm gonna. I'm gonna put something in perspective really quick. Let's just say that. The, yeah. The, what the hell? A, she a said, girl. Come on, come on. A girl was just waving. Yeah, she, I heard. I heard video. I could be wrong. I heard video. I don't. I don't know. Just, what were you saying? I don't Sorry. Know, whoever that was just kept yelling. Come on, come on. What the hell is that? Yo, somebody get buried over here? Oh, it looks like a burial mound. Like you know, like in Tonopah where they put all the rocks over, like a yeah. grave. We were just talking about it. That kind of thing. Doesn't that look like one? Oh. I mean, it, oh, from over there it looks a little different, but... Who knows what could be out here, though? We could spend all day out here. Oh um, we God. probably found two things. Is there... Alright, if we're... I'm, I'm gonna state the obvious here, the elephant in the room at this point. Is it possible that... There's, you have you guys like heard anybody or seen it? I I'm actually yes. terrible. Yes, yes. Did. Actually, did. hold on. Let me let me. Oh, you guys don't know about please, this. Dude. We were recording. We got it on camera. Yeah. A small little red car pulled up right over there. As it pulled up, two people got out of the car. A man and a woman. They they got out. No, no pictures or anything. They came out like this. So this is that little bush that's right there. They came and they stood like this, stared at us, and got right back into their little red car and drove off. And I I don't want to be that person, but that shit was a Fiat. They were a bit old. That was a Fiat. And we found Fiat keys in the last video, and I can't fucking do this shit. We found Fiat keys in the last video, and a Fiat just pulled up. <sighs> it's true. I, it just hit me right now. It just uh, hit me. Yeah, it was more Hang on a sec. I, I'm gonna address the elephant in the room at this point. Is this possible that I, I've n the only fuck, dude? This is that's nuts. Is is it possible that it all comes full circle? All come full circle, like that's Julia from the Pokemoke, or is this like? Because we've put. Now, I will give full disclosure here and play devil's advocate. We have said that we are coming to Las Vegas for. But at the end of the day, the odds of people finding us or figuring out where we're going to yeah. be, where we're staying, is so. Or do you know how big the yeah, is? Yeah, like how the, fast it's true. Is? Yeah. But Luxor Key, 
the yeah, Luxor that, that's you know, the Luxor that, I mean, key, I, that's that what's got me shaking right now is the damn Luxor. But I mean, key. we're not staying at the Luxor. We're staying at somewhere else. We're right. just not skulls in that I first. Draw for a lot. Okay, we're staying at the Strat, the Stratosphere, and we decided to stay here because it's outside of the Las Vegas Strip. It's not exactly on it. Yeah. By the time you guys watch this, we're gonna be out of there anyways because we're going to a different part of Nevada or California. I don't even know where we're doing. I don't know what to do anymore. Like, I don't even know if I want to keep playing this. I do because I want answers, but I don't just because it's like. Like, ooh, it got way out of hand real quick, like all of a sudden. The can of worms has gotten really, really big. You guys realize, though... All right, I also want to address something else. I don't think it's the app and the app creator doing this at this point. I, I think, can't, like, you know, that's I, not enough. I say that all the time, too. Yo, the theory about Random Nautica is kind of strange, obviously. But what really does me in is the fact that how easily hackable things are. We just hacked a f***ing pipeline, right? Good point, good point. The pipeline got hacked. So you're going to tell me that your cell phone's safe and that we have this thing, so-called privacy? It's not. We all know that. You yep. say something, you get a f***ing ad for it on Facebook three minutes later. Like, there's... Yeah. It, yeah, one social media crazy I mean, you're not changing those all the time. Yeah. You, can't, you can't just make new accounts. Well, no, not for nothing, but listen to this. Like, all jokes aside, me and Chris were at Walmart the other day. And we were talking about buying some some new merch for our for our merch website, right? And it was an item that literally is so obsolete. It was lanyards. I'm never I never in my life Googled a lanyard, custom lanyard. In the car, we go in the car, I go on Instagram, I look at the first story that someone posted, I swipe right, and it said custom lanyards, create them yourself. Ha, See, exactly. How, how, how exactly. are you gonna do that? Exactly. No that's searching, crazy. that's just voice. My phone was locked. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. So like if somebody was good enough with Hacking and all that kind of stuff. I mean, it's. I mean, look at the day and age. I mean, kids grow up with tablets in their hands. You know, they know how to use this stuff. And that's what I'm saying. Like, I, I feel like at this point in time, no, no, I you're don't, right. I don't think that we, we need stop. to like. We can't stop. Stop. But I also don't think we need. To, we I don't think even, we need to be naive. I think we need to be super careful that's at this point. Is. That's fuck. That's weird, dude. Yo, that's we, really we need weird. To stay nearby each other, no matter. Hell what. yeah! Like within about a 10 mile radius. Like we need to. Oh my. I've got chills all over my body right now because it just doesn't it's, feel right. It doesn't matter where we say we're going because if they want to find us, they will find exactly. us. Exactly, track. It doesn't matter. It's really anything, you know. I, I just got a new phone. I mean, but not it doesn't for matter. Like, it doesn't matter. Like you could say it's the phones. You could say whatever. I just got a new phone. What happened to our luggage? What happened to our luggage? Exactly. Right. right. We lost all our items in the luggage. The, my luggage came on another plane. Yeah. Like, yep. We don't talk about this shit enough. I'm not gonna go to Las Vegas airport and make a commotion because you know how busy and packed it is over there. They don't, they don't like, give a shit. You go to jail if you cause a commotion anymore. <sighs> we can't stop yeah, playing. We ha it died. Shit. What do you got? Guys, I, I really think at this point we need to be super, super, super careful. Absolutely. I don't think we need to. God. Like you said, we can't Damn. sit here and be like, Renault Nautica is dangerous, because I don't think it's Renault Nautica. Yeah, I, I don't whatever's think so going on. And a little disclaimer, I I sat there on the ground, Chris recorded it for the mass majority of the time, that's why the battery's dead. I tried calling you probably 15 times. I finally got a bar service, I called you, and you saw every other word yep. was like missing out of it. I couldn't hear you, couldn't hear me, but we got our point across, you came here. The only thing I want to say is like, we can't be that far from each other. No. We can't. No, no, no. I, I think a 10 mile radius at max, maybe five. Start, I mean, five start, miles is a lot in the desert. Like here's the thing, before. we gotta yeah. be careful. You go five miles that way, look where you're going. Exactly. You're gonna oh, get yeah. service and, over there? No. Oh, absolutely. we had nothing, we had no, nothing. Let's, let's no, start in the same nothing. parking lots when we start. I'm down with that. And we just keep trying. Oh my God. Damn. There's a guy that's just sitting up on the hill. White baseball hat looks like. So my phone, I can actually, if you want to see it, my phone's can I have like the hundred times zoom on this thing. I can actually see. Look, look at this. Where is it? Let me find him. Hold on, give me a sec. Let me zoom out first. It's right there. Oh shit! That is a person. Dude. Can you record that for the video? Damn. Got his face. Oh look, look, look. He's moving. He's doing something. Oh, He's yep. Look, look. He got up. He got up. He got up. We should do some followers. There he is, right there. Yo, he's walking now. That's wild. Coming out. Yeah. They were just sitting on top of that, like staring at us, directly staring at us. That guy is just chilling up there. I couldn't really see 
I don't really know how long they were up there either, but to me, that looks suspicious as hell. And oh, I even said that. I even said I felt like somebody was watching us. I know. And sure enough. Here's the thing. I know the camera's not going to pick this up. Oh my gosh. That's so weird. These humans hate. Good it luck. says good luck. Uh oh, why are they stopping? 